Hey friends and neighbors, curious about the latest trends shaking up our local housing market here in the North Atlanta suburbs? You're about to get the inside scoop on the real estate census of my favorite Georgia cities like Canton, Milton, Cumming, Woodstock, and Dawsonville. Stick around because I've got some eye-opening insights that could transform your view of the market, plus a special tidbit at the end you won't want to miss. Navigating the real estate market can be kind of tricky, especially with the lagging MLS data. But guess what? I always arm myself with the most current information on active listings to give you the clearest picture of what's available right now for your home search adventure. Ready for an accurate market snapshot? Let's buckle up and dive right in. For more detailed insights, don't forget to visit my YouTube channel, Living in North Atlanta, Georgia, or find me at Living in North Atlanta. I break down local and national market trends and give tips and tricks to keep you informed. Now, let's zoom into what's currently happening in Canton, Milton, Cumming, Dawsonville, and Woodstock. I'm Bonnie Leelock with EXP Realty, and here's the latest update. Let's start with what's happening in Canton, Georgia, 30114 and 30115. In Canton, Georgia, 30114 and 115, we have 332 active listings, a slight increase from last month's 302. Pending homes are slightly down at 136 from 139, and 127 homes closed this past month, a drop from April's 179. The average list price now stands right at $592,594, which is up slightly from last month's $591,526, with homes sitting on the market for an average of about 28 days. Milton, Georgia 30004 shows a rising trend with 89 active homes, up from 74. Pending homes have increased to 28 from 21, while closed homes dip to 16 from 23. The average days on market jumped to 26, up from last month's 10 days. Notably, 39 of these listed homes were listed in the last 30 days, with homes selling for an average of 1,600,000. $23,566 up from $1,572,532. In Woodstock, Georgia, 30188 and 30189, the active homes tally is 216, slightly up from 192, with pending homes at 132, down from 159. Closed sales rose to 140 from 118, indicating that competitively priced homes are moving fast. The average list price has increased to 516,109, which has increased from last month's 511,481. Remember, while we rely on data up to the end of May, and while May is typically active, the expected market surge wasn't as strong. With more competition out there, if you're considering selling, it's a seller's market. But success hinges more than ever on strategic marketing and pricing. Becoming Georgia 30028, 30040, and 41, there are currently 419 active homes up from last month's 355. The newly listed homes in the last 30 days account for 216, with pending sales at 185 down from 198, and closed sales at 155 down from April's 213. The average sales price is $663,135, which is down from $680,976. Dawsonville, Georgia 30534 sees 134 active homes up from 129, with pending sales at 57 up from 50. Closed sales remain steady at 36, with an average days on market of 20 days and an average sales price of $493,161, which is down from $527,522. It's important to note that not all new constructions are listed on the FMLS Georgia MLS due to associated fees. 
so there might be more options out there. While visiting a development, you might meet the on-site agents who are knowledgeable and welcoming. But remember, they represent the builder's interests, not yours. To ensure that your needs and interests are prioritized during the home buying process, it's essential to have a real estate agent who represents you. An independent agent will advocate for your best interests, negotiate on your behalf, and help uncover all available options, including those new constructions not listed on the mainstream marketplace. Connect me today and let's navigate your real estate journey together. Whether buying, selling, or just exploring, I'm here to help you every step of the way. Let's turn your real estate dreams into reality. I'm Bonnie Lelak with the Lelak Real Estate Team and EXP Realty. And remember, we love bringing people and homes together. Oh,